leave. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, I entirely share my right honourable friend's concern about the maintenance of the Belfast Agreement, the peace process in Northern Ireland, and an open border. But is not the reality of what has happened that this Brexit that is being negotiated highlights with total starkness that far from recovering sovereignty has been proclaimed, we are in fact about to part with it, replacing a bilateral agreement with the Irish Government, sustained by referendums on both sides of the border, with an arrangement on which no one has been consulted and ruthlessly undermines our sovereign rights. In those circumstances, and mindful of the fact that my right honourable friend faces many difficulties here which are not of her making, Surely we should go back to the public and ask them if that is what they want and offer them the alternative of remaining in the EU. 